Welcome to Hell. Today in this gameplay walkthrough we'll be looking at the labyrinth that is Scathe. I'm Chris, one of the three-man development team from Damage State. Join me as we take a look at the game in more detail. Scathe is our protagonist, who has been moulded by the Divine Creator for a sole purpose, to destroy his brother Sacrilegious. The time has come for Scathe to descend into Hell and reap chaos among the many deadly corridors of the hellish labyrinth. Let's start with the maze. The most unique and challenging aspect defines the level design and the metagame flow of each individual playthrough. Imagine you're the divine creator, looming over a traditional garden maze. Now imagine that the maze doesn't have one singular path to the centre, and instead has multiple. Each intersection in this maze is what we call a zone. Each zone can have up to three exits that lead on to another zone and so on. You must learn how to navigate the labyrinth. One path could lead to a new deadly weapon, and another could be a complete deadly end. To succeed in Scathe, you will need to seek the optimal path in order to best face the challenges ahead. One of the most feared demons in the underworld is the mage. These teleporting, bullet-spinning fiends once held possession of the famous Dark Relics. These Dark Relics would enable them incredible powers. Rumour has it that these mighty mages from ages past can still be located within the maze and their powers obtained. So enough about the past. In Scathe we're all about moving forward and it's time to dive into some of the Dark Relics you'll find in the Labyrinth. First up, and likely the most useful of all, the Healing Relic. When worn, this band of power pulls life to those pure of heart. Summon your collected demon souls and harness the healing powers it possesses. Healing will help your survival, but defence is no match for offence. Behold the power of Crush. With one clench of the fist, the demons become a mist of red, like a juicy pulverised fruit. Or why not embrace the cold hand of death? Unleash this dark magic energy and watch as your foes become frozen in time. Easy pickings for a headshot bonanza, but you'll need to be quick. Of course, if you can't beat them, then why not sample their evil wares with demon mode? Watch as your vision focuses and you see nothing but red. As the demon adrenaline pumps through your soul, your speed increases, your damage hits quad power, and you're invincible. Feel the power of the demon mode. Casting the relics is fun on your own, but it gets better in co-op. Summoning health provides for your whole team, not just you. So with those shared lives, you might want to keep an eye on your squad's health and unleash your inner medic. One of your team taking a beating? Pinned by demons, maybe? Time to utilise that magic. Wipe out the evil with crush, or bring on the demon mode before they get overcome. Similar to the healing relic, demon mode is enabled for all players when you cast it. When on the offensive together, why not whip out a strong team combo of all the spells? Pool your resources, dedicate an ally to healing, another to crush, make one your control master who focuses on freeze, rooting all the demons, and your last, but most important member must not spend any souls, for they're in charge of letting the inner demon out when it matters the most. There are more dimensions to how co-op works in Scathe, we've made it a truly hardcore experience. Make sure your team are in tip-top performance, as your weakest link will surely hold you back, as all lives are shared across the team. It goes without saying that weapons are at the core of any good shooter, though with the non-linear nature of Scathe, the order in which you find the weapons can vary dramatically. If you find yourself facing a difficult challenge, it might be worth seeking out a new tool with which to better deliver destruction. Right from the get-go, you'll find the Hellhammer. It'll be your old faithful throughout your travels, and will always be fully charged and ready to dish out the devastation that these devils so desperately deserve. Your primary fire will be infinitely loaded, no reloading here, but at the cost of accuracy. But who needs that when you can shred hordes of baddies in a matter of seconds? Your secondary fire will let you rain hellfire down on your foes, releasing a rocket that will rock these demons' worlds to pieces. We also have the highly accurate bow blade. According to legend, each disc was handcrafted by the divine creator. Each blade holds the power to slice right through the tough skin 
of any demon foolish enough to face the wielder. That about wraps up all the juicy details we wanted to share today ahead of our launch on August the 31st. We're really excited to bring Scathe to our community and we can't wait to see what you think in a few weeks time. I'm heading back to the demons. So long.